Do you think right. hookup culture destroys families? No, it doesn't. Yes. Absolutely. I think it does. I think it destroys how they view themselves. It does destroy the chance of having a nuclear family. People don't love each other and are, are not affectionate anymore, like unicorns, butterflies, and puppy dogs. It doesn't define anyone. It doesn't show whatever anyone is looking for. When I'm drunk, I hook up with people, right? Like, why are you doing that? Like, you could be doing so much other stuff. I don't think the hookup culture destroys families, like, directly, but I think that hookup culture is causing people to not get married, which I don't think hookup culture is a bad thing because people can do whatever they want. When we see women that heavily support hookup culture, um, we always ask ourselves, why did the guys that they hooked up with not want to stay with them? What was the lull in that? Why did they want to leave and not um, continue staying with her and building a relationship? And so I think all the evidence is there, and I think uh, that all the guys around us would say the same. Nobody wants a girl that has miles on it, just like a car. You want to find a good girl with a low body count is kind of like what you're looking for in life. Like, the last thing I want is a girl with a high body count. When I'm sober, I feel like I am a woman. I will literally do any, provide anything for my husband, which is clean the house, wash dishes, you know, make him happy. Mm -hmm. And when he comes back home, he's happy. I have everything done and everything's okay. Hookup culture is just something on the side. I would never hook up with a girl that has over 10 bodies on her. People are finding that it's better to just be single and enjoy hookup culture than get married because a lot of times marriages don't work out. Hookup culture, do you think it destroys families? Uh, hook, hook up what? Hookup culture. Hookup culture destroys families. Oh my God. Fuck no! From so they should just like date without hooking up? My rule of thumb used to be three months. Now it's kind of like a month, two months. You gotta get to know the person, know their family, like know the whole thing. And what should guys do like instead of hooking up? Honestly, meet a girl at church, meet a girl at the library, like affection is the key. Dogs, pep, puppy dogs, we are all affectionate dogs. Flowers every day. You date older guys? Yes. Why? I don't know, I'm just attracted to older guys. How much older? If you're 30, that's an ick. We're 30? Done. We're done, yeah. And how old are you? 17. <laughs> What's your most controversial opinion? Um, over 90% of American media is controlled by six different conglomerates, but six different people deciding what kind of news you get. Be very careful, use discernment, try to get to the bottom, get to the root of what these issues are. You'll figure out that there's a ton of propagandization. Um, they're trying to propagandize you, trying to make you susceptible to these weak movements. Look at COVID, look at um, all of the cultural wars, look at the what even woke means. It all goes back. You can find the root to every issue and you can find the truth from there.